my life has been different since I first heard, well, Discharge. That was the first band you became aware of that was a punk band, Discharge? Uh, well, in hindsight it, it wasn't because I was aware of the Sex Pistols and Susie and the Banshees and, you know, and stuff I was seeing on Top of the Pops. But, you know, it was more like, um, like a peripheral awareness. And, and when I heard Discharge, it sort of kicked me, you know, straight between the eyes. Um, you know, it was so unlike anything I'd heard before. I mean, I was listening to, like, I loved Killing Joke. I loved, you know, early Adam and the Ants. And, you know, these were, like, forerunners, I suppose, or, uh, well, forerunners, afterrunners, whichever, you know, whatever your uh, perception is of it. So I was listening to some punk music, but to me, punk, you know, was defined by discharge. And was it the lyrics as well as the music that, that uh, pulled you in? I don't know, really. It's, um... I think with Discharge, it's more like, um, it's something like, it's, it's almost like a primal uh, level that I felt Discharge on. Um, you know, lyrically it was fairly primitive, Music, musically it was even more so. I mean, the production left a lot to be desired, but none of that really mattered in that, you know, just the, the emotions that it stirred. Um, everything else... Uh, all the other music I was listening to at the time suddenly paled into some sort of, um, you know, insignificance, really, compared to Discharge. Yeah. And then, unfortunately, when I went back to rediscover bands like The Stranglers and The Damned, you know, who were all great musically, fantastic bands, but none of them quite, you know, could capture that intensity of Discharge. Because they became quite poppy, The Stranglers, and also The yeah, Damned, to yeah. an extent. Yeah, yeah. It's, in, it's interesting that um, as... I, I became a musician quite quickly after getting into punk and as I got better as a musician I appreciated those earlier bands more and more so I, I probably loved the Stranglers and the Damned more now than I ever did when I was younger so I think Discharge was so important because they, you know, they took the three chords that the Ramones had made you know and made famous or whatnot, and they just delivered it with a whole new, a whole new aggression, which was just so, you know, so perfect for the time, really. 